Hello, church. Would you like a, to find a simple way to help folks experience the love of Jesus in some tangible, real ways? I've got a great opportunity for you. On Sunday last week, you probably heard the good news that the Family Life Center is slated to be open again on Sunday, March the 12th, 2023. The Great Christmas Eve flood did a number on our usual modern worship space, but repairs are progressing nicely now. In our preparations for March the 12th and the full Sunday morning worship schedule, we've discovered that it takes 80 unique disciples in action or volunteers to make sure we're helping people experience the love of Jesus in the best possible ways. From the smiling face in the parking lot to the helpful folks at the welcome desk to the door greeter who invites you to have a great week on your way out of the building. This doesn't even begin to count all the Sunday school teachers, life group leaders, choir members, and children and youth ministry folks. I want you to prayerfully consider signing up to help with this in some way. Most of you are here on Sunday mornings anyhow and can prob could probably add the occasional extra responsibility. We're working really hard to get our schedules filled out through the end of May so that we can get our people trained and deployed in this important work. If you're already serving in one of these ways on Sunday morning, we've already got you in the hopper. Just keep showing up. If you need a little help figuring out what to do, what you could do, feel free to call the church office to talk with Patsy Cantor or Mark Corsi. Either one can help you. They'll help you know what's available. You can also sign up by talking to them too, but the attached link will take you to a great sign-up sheet which includes the services and the various uh, options that are available, the various needs that we have on Sunday morning. You just sign up for what seems best for you and then we'll be in touch to get you plugged in and trained. Thank you all so much for your faithful work and prayers which keep us focused, so very focused, on God's mission for our church growing disciples of Jesus Christ to know him, love him, and serve him for the transformation of Murfreesboro and the world. Thanks for giving this some thought and prayer. We'll see you soon.